Thanks for shopping at Plot Argon City Shopping Center. Come here, you old motherfucker. No, 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 no. <laughs> Evelyn and Clara, the escapers too. God, it's so fucking freezing. What time is it? Wow, it's just 7 o'clock in the morning. Better go look for more people to kill. Daddy, when am I going back to school? Well, sweetheart, you might be going back today, but I don't know. Okay. Get ready to die, bitch. No, 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 no. Wow. The bartender kicked Evelyn out of the bar because she killed his daughter. He called the police. This movie is so good. Get ready to die, black woman. No, 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 no. Wow. She goes to the hospital to murder Chief Ebony, her dad, for telling his officers to take her back home, but goes into the wrong room. Get ready to die, fatty. No, 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 no. Wow. She leaves the hospital. Get ready to die, a blue piece of shit. No, 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 no. Wow. Later. Hey, get the fuck out of my house. I'm having a shower. Get ready to die, a yellow cunt. Wow, you have a big cock. No, 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 no. Wow. She left the Wiggum's house. Hi, sweetheart. I'm a little wee gum. No one gives a shit. Now get ready to die, you fat fuck. No, 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 no. Wah. On the news. Well, I'm very fucking lazy. So I'm just gonna say I'm Carla Joshin. And I'm Paul Joshin. Gosh, this job is so fucking boring. I wish I became a doctor like my dad. Tonight, Evelyn Ebony has escaped the mental hospital, killing seven people. The names were Chris Kempster, Faye Carmichael. Minnie Peterson, Judy Smith, Nolan Handel, Clancy Wiggum, and Elliot Wiggum. And Lucy Happy Meal is too lazy to interview someone. Yep, bye. Yep, bye. Mr. Kempster was having a day off work. He heard what happened on the internet. No, Dad, why did you have to die? I know you're like 64, but I didn't want you to die until you were 93. W.A.A. Lee the bartender was down at the docks to buy some fish. He was there after he dropped Flora off at school. I saw my little girl's death at my own bar. It was hurtful to see it. Chef Chris was having surgery today. He was told what would happen to his wife. It was sad because now I've got no wife. Just my teenage daughter. Wayne Joshin was just asleep in his bed. Then Paul called him. I just got a call from my brother Paul, who told me our half-sister Judy was dead. Wah! Fuck this person who ever killed my half-sister. Nolan's parents was just randomly driving in a police car. Cause I think Nolan's mom is a police officer. My son was found dead in his own classroom, on the first day of school too. This person should be ashamed of themselves. What did he ever do wrong? Ella Clancy Wiggum was doing nothing so she turned on the news and heard that her father and twin brother died. No dad and twin brother died at death. Wow. Later, what the absolute fuck is happening?
Oh shit. I better run. When she roomed. Phew. Where do you think you're going, young lady? Um. You're grounded. The end. Yep, bye. And again another yep, bye. Here's the secret ending. Oh shit. See you. Yep, bye.